free throws late, but there's some misses early in the game. Oh, it wasn't necessarily when you needed them. That's what you guys did. Yeah, I think guys just stepped up to the moment when, when the time came. You know, obviously we'd like to make them throughout the game. And TJ had a bunch that kind of rattled out. And, you know, I think Ty had a couple that rattled out. But, you know, at the end of the day, we had to drop it. Mark, it feels good, but TJ hits one in the corner. Luke comes up. I think the next possession gets, uh, gets that three. It felt like a big three. Like, you remember maybe what you thought in, in the moment that Luke went in? I was happy. Uh, sure. <laughs> Yeah, I, I was happy. You know, I felt like throughout the whole game, we were getting a lot of open looks when they were doublers. You know, we were kind of inviting the double team and then just passing and playing out of it. And I felt like we were getting a lot of open threes that we were missing. You know, we hit them at the start and then we missed them for a while. And a lot of the conversation at the time was just continue to do what we're doing. You know, we're getting good looks and our guys hit them when it mattered. Marcus, I almost caught your reaction on that and one. You know, it had been, it just seemed like it's such a struggle to, for you to get anything offensively and any, any room offensively. When you hit that, did you just kind of let it go and go, okay, finally something fell? Um, you know, honestly, I, I really wasn't I wasn't mad at myself. You know, I felt like I I played a, a really solid offensive game. You okay. know, I obviously missed some shots I could have made, but I felt like our game plan was to invite the doubles, and I was just going to pass out of it, and we were going to play out of that. And, you know, I felt like I played a really solid game making my reads. You know, when I, when I had the N1, I really just laid there to catch my breath. You know, so, sometimes I get tired out there, so I just laid there to catch my breath. Mark, when you transferred here, did Coach talk about an NCAA tournament? Or did you feel like you had the teams like against like, this floor? Was like, yeah, that's that's pretty much all we talked about, honestly. You know, we talked about how far we could go and if we could win games in the tournament. You know, that's why I entered the portal. That's why I came here to win games in the tournament. And who, who, else was, who else were you looking at? Was it, was, was it an easy decision for Illinois? Or like, did, it, did it come together pretty quickly, I guess? Um, honestly, yeah. At one point in the portal, I, I thought I was going to go to Iowa State. Uh, really? Yeah, so, you know, I got a good relationship with those coaches and a lot of respect for them and what they do there. Um, but I think once I came on my visit to Illinois, you know, it was just a no-brainer. This was spot for me. Did you know these guys at all, uh, the, the coaches, or just playing uh, at Southern Illinois, like, from recruiting in high school or other things? Did you know those guys? No, out of high school, I wasn't recruited by any schools, <laughs> but, uh, no, I, I didn't know them. You know, it was really, a, it was a quick quick turn I think they reached out to me like a week later I was committed. Marcus what was the it just seemed like they were trying to deny you the ball or at least make you give you pressure at three quarter court just how did you maintain energy throughout the entire game when somebody's trying to do that to you? Yeah they were trying to make me you know work for all catches send the double team and do all that stuff uh, you know I think you know it's all just about not fighting it you know a lot of times I just do it to Ty let him bring it up do it to Justin let him bring it up you know and just you know, not fight it and then just get back in our offense. How big was Coleman tonight? It just seemed like everything that he got was just another. I know it allowed you to spread the floor even more tonight. Yeah, uh, you know, Coleman's ability to shoot it. You know, it just a lot of five men don't know how to guard that. You know, and especially with them doubling and Coleman just spotting up in the three point line. I thought he passed up some that he should have shot. You know, I think he could have shot a couple more, but you know, he's just great for us. Great for our spacing. I think he needed 